so retainability kpis now some of you know about retainability kpis and as i say always when it comes to kpis it all depends on what the end user perceives in other words for to define any kpi retainability in general definition depend on from a user perspective the ability of a user to retain its requested service or finish its service depending on the desired duration in other words uh, just like accessibility definition is ability of a user to obtain requested service same is the definition same on the same notes the definition of retainability is ability of a user to finish its service in its desired duration let's just say that or ability of a user to retain its session for the desired duration what do i mean by this in case if you're doing some transaction through your phone your phone or your connection with your uh, eNodeB should not close unexpectedly so or if you are uh, on a call for let's say the next two hours the call should not be dropped unexpectedly as long as your session is running if you are if you hang up the call and then the session uh, does not remain connected or the UE goes into idle mode that's another story but in general retainability refers to the fact that if you are in the middle of doing an activity as a user through your UE or phone the session should not close abruptly so when it comes to measuring retainability it depends on uh, what are you measuring it depends on you can measure the number of drops unexpected drops which can happen uh, while you are when, while a ue is in session or it can also depend the percentage of time the number of uh, drops happen let's say in a, a, a one hour session how much percentage of time the session was uh, available Having said that, there are two types of retainability. One is normal retainability, the other one is abnormal retainability. When I say normal and abnormal retainability, that is in other words used as the term abnormal release or abnormal release. Um, normal release or normal retainability will be where the session gets closed down successfully after the user has ended the session him or herself so that will be considered as normal release and that will not affect the end user negatively whereas if the session gets closed or turned down unexpectedly and the user will be impacted negatively that is termed as abnormal release so or abnormal retainability so these two points are also taken needs to be taken into consideration when you think or talk about retainability